Hi everyone, Jamie here with Zing. I just wanted to get on here really quick and talk a little bit about tree care. Uh, last fall, I was here at this, uh, this neighborhood here in Middleton and I was uh, attending a, a soccer mom meeting. We were discussing our high school seniors senior night coming up and I pulled up and I walked over to where the group was meeting and they were meeting just, just underneath this tree over here. And before I get out, I'll just explain what, um, what I noticed when I came and sat down underneath this tree. Um, I sat down on the bench here and I noticed that the bench was a little bit sticky and there was a little bit of a film on there. And then a few moments later, um, us moms were kind of swatting, shooing away some wasps and kind of shuffling, uh, shuffling around um, because there were these wasps flying around and, and I instantly thought, I think there's something going on with this tree. And just um, being in the zing industry and knowing a little bit about lawns and trees, I kind of knew the uh, symptoms when you have insects and trees. So I, I instantly looked up and it was covered with cottony maple scale. And I don't know if you're familiar with cottony maple scale, but it, it just looks like little white cotton balls all along the little branches in the tree. And those are the egg sacs of this particular insect. And um, I started taking pictures and I will attach a picture to this, um, this post so you can see that picture that I took on that day. Um, but I just wanted to stop here really quick and take a look at it and then talk a little bit more about um, how to treat cottony maple scale. Okay, so I'm here in this uh, common area of this neighborhood right here by the high school. And I just wanted to show you this tree that I was talking about. So I'm gonna switch the camera. Okay, so here are those benches that we were sitting on underneath this tree early last fall. And obviously this tree was in full bloom at the time. And if we look closely, we can still see the remnants of those cottony maple scale egg sacs and they are just all over these branches and they go up and down this tree. So cottony maple scale obviously likes maple trees but it can also attack other woody plants as well and if left untreated it can severely weaken the tree and cause some branch dieback. And here at Zing, we, we have a, an arborist with us with many years of experience, but he can properly and professionally uh, treat cottony maple scale, and he can either do that with a foliar spray or a trunk injection. Okay, so that was cottony maple scale, and it's just one of the common tree issues that we have here in the Treasure Valley but we are just getting ready to start our tree care program for the year and our first application here in February and early March um, it's a it's a dormant oil application and basically what that is it's just a waxy film that we coat the the tree trunks and the tree branches with and that will suffocate any insect eggs that are present that may have survived the winter and we we did have a mild winter this year so so we may have some insect issues this year in the Treasure Valley on trees and woody plants. Um, but that, that our program is just getting ready to start and um, we can also do a walkthrough um, with you and, and look at each one of your trees. We've, we've, we've been able to help the city of Middleton with one of their city parks here and we, we walked through their park and came up with a tree care um, maintenance and treatment program for each tree and we can we can do that for you uh, with your with your trees on your property we can do that for city parks we can do that for HOA common areas and we can customize those tree care programs um, and prioritize the trees that that need immediate intervention um, otherwise they they may uh, end up those trees may end up dying so we can we can put emphasis on those trees that need immediate attention and then we can also um, identify the other trees that are starting to show signs of stress that could also benefit for, from some tree care and 
Um, it's a it's a good way to get your trees protected and ready for the the new season coming up and um, if trees are left alone if they're planted and just just forgotten about they can succumb to um, insects and disease pretty easily so uh, trees do need care and nutrients to be healthy and strong and to reach their full potential and and that's where a zine can come in so if you'd like some help with your trees this year and uh, protecting your investments give zing a call and we can we can definitely help you with that okay thanks bye